Hey. Hi. Okay, give me a second. I'm going to do something. Sure. Ta-da! Whoa, nice. Where'd you get that? I actually made it myself. Um, it was really easy to make. I can show you how to do it if you want. Yeah, sure. All right, sweet. Let's do it. So to make your own Microsoft Teams virtual background, you can head over to Kapwing Studio, kapwing.com slash studio. I'll link it in the description below and click get started. And once you get here, you can either start with a blank canvas or upload an existing photo. Um, I'm going to just start with a blank canvas. And the key thing you want for your virtual background is for the size to be 16 by 9 at output ratio. This is the size that Microsoft Teams will use so you can ensure it's properly formatted in your screen when you add it as a background. So from here on, it's just up to you whatever you want to do with your background. You can add anything from text to images to shapes and layer as many things as you want on your canvas. Unfortunately, Microsoft Teams does not support GIFs or videos at this time, but hopefully they'll add that in the future. One cool idea for making a background, especially for a business or professional setting, is to have your company logo or other features of your company with your name and maybe contact information or title on there. So that's the one I had in the intro for this video. Um, basically how I made it is I just imported um, our Kapwing Kitten logo. So I just copy and pasted a bunch of these cats everywhere. Now I'm gonna add some text for my name, Grace. And with any of these text boxes, you can adjust how they look on the side. So this is the background that I came up with in the end. And uh, I'd suggest leaving a sort of space for your body to be in. So this is where my face would be. And once you're done with how, and you like how your background looks, you can just go ahead and click publish. Eventually it'll load and to save this background, you can click download. So to actually add your background to Teams to a Teams call now, you can just hit the more actions, three dots um, on the toolbar below, then click show background effects. If you wanna add your own that you just made, you can click add new and upload the the thing you just made in Kapwing, and it will show up at the very bottom. And then you can just select it and click apply, and it will be in your background. Wow, thanks, that's so easy. I'm gonna go make one now. Awesome, sweet, I'm looking forward to seeing it. So if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and click the bell to get notifications from our channel, and let us know what other videos you want us to make in the comments below. See you next time.